All right, let's follow the money. We've got a client, a mid-sized construction company bleeding cash. Profits are down, but nobody knows why. They suspect something's off and they've called us in to find it. So I start where the money goes out. Accounts payable. I'm scrolling through months of payments, thousands of them. It's a digital haystack. But forensic accountants, we love haystacks. I start by sorting payments by vendor. And one name keeps popping up. Apex Innovative Solutions. Lots of payments all for consulting services. Red flag number one, consulting is vague. It's a classic way to hide shady payments. So I pull the invoices from Apex. They look legit, at first. Professional letterhead, invoice numbers, dates. But something feels templatey, too perfect. Now for the real check. I cross-reference Apex Innovative Solutions in the state's business registry. And nothing. The company doesn't exist. It's a phantom, okay, so who's getting the money? I trace the bank transfers for the Apex payments. And they're all going to a personal account. An account belonging to, you guessed it, the company's own accounts payable manager. He was creating fake invoices, approving them himself, and paying himself for services never rendered. Over two years, he siphoned off nearly half a million dollars. Game over, we found our ghost.